around 100 feet now, right? I see, yeah, 95. Got something. As I was dropping it down, got a baby link on. Tiny baby link hat. Hey guys, thank you for tuning in to Moon Outdoors. Today I'm out here at Monterey Bay uh, with my buddy James. Today I'm doing something that I've never done before, which is uh, fishing for white sea bass. Uh, it's kind of late in the season, but I thought you know, give it a shot, you know, learn a thing or two. Uh, white sea bass is probably uh, the most prized fish in NorCal. They're a little more common in so uh, Southern California, but up here they are rare and we call them ghost. So I'm using three rods right now. One is a fly line, basically top section, and, uh, and a little bit over two ounce weight. Uh, hitting the middle section around uh, 60 feet. I'm at about 120. Uh, eight feet of water, so this is down to 60 feet, and my third rod is all the way down in the bottom, just a few feet off the off the bottom. I'm um, using a uh, frozen squid. Um, my buddy James is trying to catch a uh, fresh live squid, so we can use that for bait. But meanwhile, we're gonna use a frozen squid. Squid. And this is a fish that uh, everybody wishes to catch, and is. Uh, for a lot of people is uh, maybe once in a lifetime deal so let's see what we can get uh, I already got rockfish stealing my bait and it's got a small link cut um, while just waiting and drifting so let's see if we can get anything oh that's it oh! Oh, another oh, rockfish. So even if we catch a legal size leaf cut or a good size rockfish, we can't keep them because uh, we are using uh, three rods. Uh, rockfish leaf cut regulation is you can only fish with one rod. So since we have uh, three uh, rods in the water, we cannot keep them. That's against the regulation. And uh, we are targeting white sea bass. So we're just gonna move uh, for a little bit. Try to get away from this uh, link cut and rockfish. Yeah. Uh, I was getting beat on the top water, yeah. middle, and the bottom everywhere. Keep stealing my bait. Something? Rockfish stealing my bait. Bend though. Ooh, nice size walkfish. I got a squid. You got a squid? Yeah. Yay! On the bottom. Go get more. <laughs> bendo, bendo. All right, for sure. Oh, came off.
Got it. Oh, he broke me off. What the heck? Hey, something broke me off! Really? Yeah, he made a run and broke me off! Good size rock fish. like a link heart. Another good sized rockfish. There. Rockfish. Well, we finally got away from the rockfish and Linka, so it's been quiet. It's been very quiet. I'm getting bored, so I'm gonna try to catch some sand dabs. And uh, I got a squid. Got a squid? Yeah. Nice. Got a squid. I'll put a fresh squid on here. Another squid! Another squid! Let's put the fresh squid on here! Two! They're on here now! On the line? Yeah! And I got four sand depth so far. Now I'll probably go for some rockfish and then head into. Okay. Yeah, I may try it. rockfish a little bit. I mean, yeah. there's... there's a bite. Yeah, Linka, hopefully he's keeper. So James and I are trying to salvage the day with uh, with some rockfish and Linka. As you can see, we are only using one rod this time, so whatever we keep the catch, we can keep it. PB worm. Oh, nice. I gotta measure it. Oh, nice red over here.
19 and a half. Wow. 19 and a half. It is my PB. My last PB was uh, 19. My PB red. Oh. He salvaged the day already. Oh, he swallowed it too. I'm gonna cut it off, get the hook out later. Buddy. One down, nine more to go. Huh? I said one down, nine more to go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably stay it's just a little bit longer. Sending down the sand dab this time. Oh. Yep, keeper. 